It's 16 laps. 800, the second longest event. So, just to say some words about the competitors, uh, Maur Goranlik, uh, lane 8 representing Israel last year. Uh, he was also in the Auto Panidari. European Championships, but at the preliminaries uh, he achieved the 17th place. That wasn't enough for the uh, final, of course. Multinations Junior Meet, uh, participant last uh, year. Then uh, Tyler Melbourne Smith, we already met him in longer distances. Uh, uh, British World Championship Trials, uh, new personal best just a couple of weeks ago. In 400 and 800 finals as well. Uh, his 800 finals uh, was the time of 8:06:34, which was which was in a 44th place, and also new personal best in 1500. Uh, so this is uh, Melbourne's Vlad Stefan Stanku. We I already mentioned uh, silver medalist in the 1500, and uh, last year in this event uh, he was also the silver medalist. Uh, uh, in 18 and the winner the, of the 1500 but now he couldn't uh, defend the title because there was a faster guy called uh, Kuzey Tuncelli who was uh, not just the faster but uh, break, uh, broke the European Junior uh, the championship record as well Stanko Tuncelli of course the first two it's not a surprise then uh, Tuncelli the new uh, rising star of the Turkish swimming, uh, breaking the world record in, and winning the 1500. Next to her lane four with the best time, Emir Al Bayrak, uh, uh, bronze medalist in uh, the 1500, and last year also bronze medalist in the 1500, and Youth Olympic Festival silver medalist uh, in 1500 freestyle. Petar Mitsin, winner of the 200 meter freestyle here, and the first gold goes to Bulgaria. Filippo Bertoni, the Italian lane two. And uh, the Italian guy was uh, finalist of the World Ch Junior Championships four times 200 meters bronze medal, sixth place in 1500 and 400 freestyle, and seventh place in 800. Youth Olympic Festival two-time champion last year in 1500 and 200. And also finalist in, in 400. Stanku, Mitsin and Tuncelli, the first three within uh, one second after 300 meters. And uh, last but not least, uh, uh, Mati Hartmann, the Hungarian, one of the new talented guys for the longer distances in uh, Hungary. So that's all about the guys the most important facts and now let's see the competition it's a uh, very tough race maybe Stanku wants to give a revenge for Tunjeli as well that after beating the Turkish beating him in the 1500 Stanku, Mitsin and uh, Tunjeli so curious about Petar Mitsin one of the poster boy of the Bulgarian swimming that uh, it was a Excellent performance, what he achieved in 200 meter, winning the 200 meter freestyle in front of uh, Ragaini and Beishnit. Uh, but now it's a uh, uh, longer distance, and now he's the, in a leader position, 3 53 28 after halfway, after fifth, uh, 400. The world junior record and European junior record hold is Lorenzo Gallus. He actually, last year, he was the champion uh, beating uh, Stanku and uh, Krzysztof Chmielewski in the final and uh, the championship record holder is uh, the Turkish Yigit Aslan with a 7.51 20 time and Galos's record is uh, from last year 7.43.37 the European record is by Gregorio Padrinieri it's a 7.39.27 Maybe another record breaking, who knows? 
lane three, Petar Mitsin is still the leader. And about almost uh, one body length clear for the Bulgarian. The second is Tanku and then uh, Tuncelli. 4.51.98. It's a pretty hard rhythm for the, this longer distances, but maybe Mitsin knows what he's doing and now just extending the lead it's now more than one body length uh, Stanku I guess uh, realizing this and uh, changing the pace uh, with stronger and longer strokes uh, he wants to operate almost two seconds advantage Tuncelli and Stanku so close to each other maybe Tuncelli has a half body length disadvantage Mitsin in, in this position uh, and this movement he can also see the two opponents if they are approaching to him or not 200 meters to go and Mitsin's time is 5 50, 91 then Stanku more than 2 seconds disadvantage and Tunchen Albayrak maybe Albayrak uh, uh, focused on the in the on the fight to qualify into the final because even he had uh, he had the best time uh, he's so far from the first three meets in still and now just 150 to go 650 50 uh, fix 6 uh, 20 55 and uh, still extending the time the gap the between the two opponent and now it's maybe more than two tenths of a second and just 100 meter to go but we know that Stanku is able to make a 100 meter sprint at last so I guess it's not an official result that Mitsin is the leader and now as I mentioned Stanku is changing the pace and uh, it's so very it's very dangerous for Petar Mitsin who seems a bit tired after 700 meters but not Stanku Is uh, da does uh, is uh, Mitsin able to withstand the pressure? What gets from Stanku or not? Just one body length clear right now. Tuncelli maybe out of the race. Mitsin and uh, Stanku seven nine and it's more than two seconds uh, between uh, the two competitors. Maybe Mitsin is uh, realized that now he had to change the pace as well if he wants to win this. 800 meter and Mitsin did this and he saved enough energy to win the title enough energy to withstand the pressure and enough energy to bring the second gold medal to team Bulgaria at this moment 7 47 40 uh, 45 Stanku and uh, Tuncelli as well and here we have a new European Junior Championship record by Petar Mitsin after winning the 200 meter freestyle now it's another gold around uh, his neck and this is another record breaking uh, performance congratulations to Petar Mitsin and Tunchali after winning the 1500 it's a Bronze, Albayrak, the fourth, Bertoni, Melbourne, Smith, Horton, then Goralnik. Now we have uh, four new records. Three championship records and one ju European junior record, but it's also, of course, a championship record. Thanks for